I've done this for every kid. Fifth time doing it, my last time doing it. That's the latest and greatest though. This boy walking is like crazy. I guess the last two kids just wanna keep up. Don't ya? day 100 of me working on no I'm actually kidding it's not day 100 um, it feels like that I can tell you for definite that it has been hours upon hours move what stuff but this is the stuff I'm working on but where can I sit why don't you sit right here how about right here with me. Yeah, I'll I'll sit right here with you and I'll work over here while you work over there. Is that fine? No, you color with me. Oh, I need to color with you? Mm-hmm. Why? Now what, what now what one can I do? What one of what could you do? Oh, that's a beautiful picture. What about that one? No. Mm. Oh, fun. Okay, back to what I was saying though. I have spent hours upon hours upon hours upon hours, which probably do add up to like quite a lot. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. You make an oval for me. Anyway, hours of baby books. I am super old school, whatever you want to call it. I just love the old, beautiful, like, thought out scrapbooking. I just, I don't know. There's something about it that's just special. It reminds me of my grandma. I think it's just like cute. I like the whole like handmade aspect of it. I know I could print like something super cute online and just be done with it, but I've done this for every kid. Fifth time doing it, my last time doing it. I don't want to do this again because it's just hours of, from the time they are newborn. I, I actually literally start my pregnancy through like ultrasounds, doctor's appointments, all the way up until like birth, and then from birth to a year of their life. So each baby book is from zero to 12 months. It always has their first birthday included in the back of the book. Um, and it's just like step by steps, like basically, so that whenever they get married and I give them these books, that they're keepsakes, but they also have Something to compare like when they have children. Like, oh, look what I look like at two months, or three months, or four months. It's not complete, obviously. I'm up to seven months right now, so I still have eight, nine, and he just is turning 10 months in a few days. So, I have to finish those months, but then I'll be like done for now, until he gets to 12 months. Can we see your teeth again? Right here, can we see your teeth? <gasps> can we see your teeth? <gasps> hey. That's the latest and greatest though. This boy walking is like crazy. Macy was the only other child that we had that walked at that like that early of age. So she was also nine months, <laughs> just like you. But she actually was almost like a little closer to 10 months than he was when he started. So crazy. I guess the last two kids just want to keep up. Don't you? Okay then, I guess so. This is a momentous day. You'll never guess why, okay? I came in to something <laughs> that I've always wanted to do but don't know how to do because I'm terrible at it, so here it is. Are you ready? <laughs> Alyssa has decided to make me something. It's because, you know, when John and I got to eat to this particular type of restaurant, I never eat this recipe. I just, yeah. Leave it for John because he loves it and he eats mine and his. I eat it because I love it. So it's my favorite thing at a Japanese restaurant. Yeah. This the soup. soup. And you know what it's called? <laughs> What's it called? I'm, I'm not pronouncing it right, probably, and I'm not embarrassing myself. You All say I know it. is it's called pho. So <laughs> I don't know if that's right or not, but well, the whatever it is, Japanese clear it, soup. 
Yeah, whatever, whoever thought of it, genius. It's, I love it, it's yeah. my favorite thing. It's crazy because you wouldn't know that this is how you make it. Like, because they boil all this stuff in it and then they take it out and just leave the clear soup part. Oh, wow. They don't leave like the carrots. I don't know anything stuff. about it, I just like to eat stuff. I'm yeah. the greatest taste tester of all time. So. Yeah. Today is a great day. Well, okay, I made a recipe, like a knockoff of this because I didn't have the real ingredients and so I kind of made something up and made it yesterday. It was not very good, it was kind of a fail. But Macy loved it. That was pretty good. And it was like okay, but it wasn't great. This one smells like 10 times better than the other one. The whole house and smells beautiful. It actually does smell good. I mean, but they the say best. that, cut up, like, all the stuff but they, listen, it says this soup is best on the second day. Look, we Look, even got our, second our phone that we need. Oh, uh, yeah, so. Macy put that there. Yeah, just but in case. But it's better like if you here's the use recipe it long if you want. term. So cook it ahead and it'll be better the next time. That's what this they say. Is the greatest meal I've ever come home to. It's easy to impress, I guess. Yes. Because it's just soup. But It's not sure. just soup. It's <laughs> pho. Right. <laughs> right. Where are we going? Costco. Costco? Our favorite store with little buddy. We should do Walmart delivery, but the kids love going to Costco, so we just we go there. We love going because all together. We love it because it has ice cream. Oh, uh, now we know the real truth because it has ice cream. No. Look, little buddy says that. that. Look at him. He's like ice cream. Somebody said ice cream. Flavors. Oh. Here we have a variety of four flavors. Which one should I get? Well, this has more options. This only has three flavors. What this flavors are those? Four flavors. What's the three flavors? Uh, this is grape raspberry, black raspberry, lemonade, cherry lime. This is winter punch, cranberry frost, and apple cider. Disgusting. <laughs> I think we're gonna go with option one. <laughs> Who's the happy boy? Yeah. <laughs> Not really? Macy, can you say banana? Banana. A banana? <laughs> banana. <laughs> banana. <laughs> can you it's give cute. Me a banana? It's card made for chilling. So I can banana. <laughs> Two hours later. Not actually, but kind of. Left when it was light. Arrived when it was dark. But I arrived with pizza, soda, leftover coffee and a lot of kids and a lot of groceries. So, I guess let's go get everybody carried inside and all the groceries put away. Yay! <laughs> What is happening? What do you need? Oh, a pizza. Yes, let's have a pizza. A pizza for Macy. It looks like somebody ate half of it on the way here. I wonder how that happened. <laughs> it wouldn't be mom and dad, would it? Zoe, you ate half the pizzas? Unbelievable. Why do I get the one that's eaten? They we ate eat. all of them. They might all be eaten like that. <laughs> Not like a pizza of every pizza. And I hear the mortal. Hey, <laughs> that's mine. Hey, that tummy and the tummy. Where's yours? Oh, still working. What is it? No, she's getting apple juice out. Oh. She's getting apple juice for herself. <laughs> Daddy said, "Oh, Allie's working." She kind of she getting the out for herself. <laughs> that matters. That matters. <laughs> it matters, Allie. Good yeah, job. You guys got soda. Yeah, good job. And so you got this. Yeah. Okay. Well, I guess that's good a fair job. deal. All right. Well, what do you say about the shopping experience? I like it. Okay. That is a lot of apple juice. I feel like that's too much to drink at eight o'clock at night. It, it actually is. It's lemon lime. 
<laughs> I wonder why I was saying that. So I was like, lemonade. Macy left her in the car. Macy, I'll go get your soda. No, Macy's okay. is empty. She drank it. Oh, Macy, you drank all yours? <laughs> I got you, so I'll get you a water. I'll get you some of mine, Macy. It's okay. Let's do some water. It's okay. <laughs> Mine's over here. That's it, guys. We have to go finish doing all this and all that. So until next week, we shall see you guys later. See ya. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.